Thermal imaging systems are being incorporated into aircraft, as demonstrated by this night aerial view of a busy highway through FLIR, the forward-looking infrared system. The Army has chosen the Huey helicopter to test FLIR's capability for surveillance, target acquisition, fire control, and limited navigation during all hours and through all visibility conditions. Pilot, co-pilot, and gunner receive the picture information from the detector array located on the helicopter's nose on TV-like screens. The system's nighttime surveillance capability is dramatically demonstrated by these night scenes of familiar landmarks of the nation's capital. The system works best at night when warm bodies stand out more clearly against the cooler ambient temperature. But it is also quite effective in daylight when it may be used to spot camouflaged vehicles or weapons. Note the ability of the system to determine the amount of fuel in these storage tanks. The FLIR sees the temperature difference between the fuel and the metal tanks. Significant strides have been made by the U.S. Armed Forces in FLIR technology in the wake of the Army's successful launching of the system in Vietnam, where it was instrumental in detecting movement of supplies down the Ho Chi Minh Trail. The Army, the Navy, and the Air Force have been coordinating their FLIR effort with an eye to saving through standardization. All three services have been installing standard far-infrared imaging sensors into a variety of attack and surveillance aircraft, as well as ground and shipboard air defense systems and remotely piloted vehicles. 